So you guys ready for another Mr. Chiggles adventure? Mr. Chiggles. That's my new name, by the way. Um, well, we're out on the river today, and I wanted to go scuba diving. They're calling for four inches of rain tomorrow, or as you say in Deutschland, four inches of rain tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, so I wanted to get one more good dive in on the river, or at least river treasure hunt. You can see the water's really clear, so I'm excited, but it's already raining. Look at that. <laughs> of course, we're going to be wet anyway. I brought all my scuba gear. I have two tanks and my wetsuit and all the good stuff, so we should be okay today, as long as we, we're only halfway there. So, uh, we'll go ahead and move out. Um, one thing. Whoever can guess the reference to what I'm about to say, and is the first one to post it, gets a free Aqua Chigger sticker, or Chig's Army sticker. Ready? They call me Mr. Chiggles. Go. You old timers will know exactly what I'm talking about. All right, let's head out. This grass in here is really slowing us down. That's been a big problem. Now, we should have been there by now, but I have to keep stopping and cleaning out the jet back there which is a little bit of a pain, but oh well. All right. We can't go very fast because we have a lot of weight. I have all my tanks and my dive weights and all that stuff. Probably up to good, close to 250 pounds. Well, I have good news and I have bad news. Uh, we have reached our destination. Good, not raining. Good. Looks like it's going to storm like crazy very soon. Not so good. Also, the river was, uh, the rapids I had to go through were terrible, and I had to jettison one of my air tanks. So we only have one uh, scuba tank today. Plus, it took me about two hours to get here. I was only expecting about a 45 minute ride. So we only have two hours, <laughs> and that's if a thunderstorm doesn't come up. So if I hear thunder, we're gonna have to start moseying out. Let's go look at the actual spot we're gonna be diving. This is the little slot we're gonna look in today. You can see the rapids off to the left. Uh, that's where people have a tendency to flip in their kayaks and stuff. So let's go grab the scuba tanks and dive in. Gonna be a short hunt. Might not find anything, but we have to do it because we're here. <laughs> God, it looks terrible up there. Hope this wind isn't bothering you, but I was headed back to the boat and I see some river treasure. That's our first piece of the day. Awesome. Well, I guess it's actually our second piece because I picked up some sunglasses. I actually ran over fishing rod back here in about four feet of water, but I knew I was running out of time, so I didn't even stop for it. It looked like a cheap Zepco anyway. Well, I just checked my phone and the flash flood watch starts in four hours, so. Uh, it gives us one hour in the water, and then we got to get the heck out of here because it could take us a couple hours to get back. Probably not, but uh, they're calling for, like I said, like four inches of rain starting uh, the, tonight. And it looks ugly now. <laughs> Short video! Thank <laughs> you. 
I think we did really good. We got a GoPro Hero 4. That's like the fourth or fifth one this season. Uh, we have to hit the road. I might do some video on the way out that will roll after the credits. It's a pretty gnarly rapids we have to go through. Let's go ahead and take a look at what we found. Look at all the stuff we found today. I think we did awesomely awesome. Uh, the scuba diving worked out great here. I got a bunch more places we can check out in the future. Uh, I just hope this rain doesn't mess us up for the rest of the year. We got a GoPro Hero 4 and it looks like it's going to be in fine shape. The uh, Sony camcorder here is definitely flooded, but we'll see if we can get some footage off of that. Carrying out the battery, that's going to be pretty toxic to the animals. The several pairs of Ray-Bans, there's one if they're real. Got a couple more in here. Uh, yeah, so we did really good. I love it, man. That was awesome. That was a good dive. One candy bar. What do you think? Suitable for a Mr. Jiggles? Let's check it out and see if it's dry. I think it looks pretty good. American chocolate. Probably nothing ever go wrong with this stuff. You, you could dip it in the toilet in order to come out with no bacteria on it. What do you say? It's good enough for the aqua chigger. It's good enough for Mr. Chiggles. Oh yeah, baby. Now we're talking! Let's get out of here. Yeah, we're cutting it really close to the darkness tonight. <laughs> Mrs. Chiggles isn't going to be happy with us. She's not real happy with us either, to be honest with you. Um, one big set of rapids down here. Well, it's not huge, but we got to get through it and pick up my scuba tank, which is in the bushes, hopefully, right down here. I hope no one made off with it. That's kind of weird. Yeah, this is a little bit hairy coming up. I had to take one of the tanks out of the boat to make it. Now this fire is going to sink. Oh. Already scared. Alright, hold on. <laughs> Don't hold your breath, but hold on. Yeah, I'll go down the middle, I reckon. Yeah, that's not bad. The, uh, when I had the other tank in there going up, it wanted to dip the nose under, so... Hopefully the tank is in the bushes over here where I left it. Out. I don't remember that bag being there. A little shallow right here. Woo! All right. Let's see. Our scuba tank is still up here. I hope it is. This is where people camp and hang out. Out. You can see you got a skillet there and a bag of trash, of course. Of course. Yeah. Well, it's a couple footprints. They're fairly fresh. I hid it up here in the bushes, so hopefully it's still here. I'm hoping. Yeah, it's going to be dark probably in about 45 minutes, and we have about 30 minutes to get back to the vehicle. Mm, give or take. Let's see how. Where do we put it? Do you remember? I think it was right up here in the poison ivy. I picked a good spot. I also smelled some paw paw. Of course, you can see where I broke over all the uh, things walking up here. I covered up a little bit. The, uh, anybody that was a good tracker would have known someone came up in here. All right. That's it for the adventure. Thanks for hanging out with me. I hope I didn't annoy you too much with the Mr. Chiggles, but I thought that was pretty funny.
and uh, we'll get back at it again, I promise. Another day, another adventure. Um, we'll see you later. I'll quit talking now, I promise. My belly hurts, by the way, that candy bar really, uh, nah, that's not the candy bar. <laughs> of course not.